We're here in Des Moines, Iowa at the Duel in Des Moines, and we have saw a car here that we really did like, and so we came around and we wanted to ask about it. Tell us about your car. It's a 1969 Camaro. It was originally built in the early 90s as a, a dirt stock car that was uh, raced around the tracks in Iowa. Uh, it's a 69 Camaro on a three-quarter ton Chevy truck chassis is what it started out with. And uh, after racing it for four years, I parked it and sat in the shed for about 15 years. And uh, a guy came along and asked if I still had it. And I said, yes, and wanted to know if he could buy it. And I said, yes. Okay. And that's what we have here today. We did a total makeover on it, lightened it up, cleaned it up, rebuilt the engine, put uh, street tires and wheels on it, and uh, brought it out to run these autocross races. Great, great. And you're Jimmy Johnson? That's my name, Jimmy Johnson. Okay. And you are? Don Warnicky. And Don, you're the buyer or the owner of the car, Ned. Owned yeah. it for four years. Okay. Is this your first autocross with it, or have you been? This is our fourth year. This is our fourth year here. Fourth year here. All right. All right. Well, uh, what kind of engine and transmission are you running? Uh, it's just a big block Chevy, 427, um, 30 over, so it's like a 468, four speed. Okay. Uh, nine inch Ford rear end, 411. Great. And you say it started out as, as a dirt car. Yep. Yeah, it was built to race the uh, dirt tracks in Iowa. And uh, we were actually a nostalgia class, so we didn't wreck very much. Okay. But, <laughs> but we did. I wrecked the car two different times. So we were, we were playing serious. And uh, we raced oh, probably a dozen different tracks around Iowa in four, in four years that I raced it. So what all did, did you do to take it from the dirt to autocross? Well, first of all, we got rid of the 460-pound rear end that was under it <laughs> and put the 9-inch forward rear end. And also on the front, we lightened up the front suspension and uh, rebuilt the motor, put, uh, put in a Borg Warner 4-speed instead of a Muncie, and basically cleaned up the paint that was on it and saved as much as we could. Some of this is still the original paint from the early 90s. We just spot painted and then re-clear coated the car to make it look nice. And that's, that's basically it. And then been maintaining it ever since. Okay. I see, and Don, you're driving the car today. Yes. I, I've seen you out there a couple times. You're running good. Thank you. Uh, we did add, uh, I want to add that we did put bear brakes on it and a ride tech okay. suspension. Okay. That helped. Uh, that was after our first year. Okay. We showed up. Uh, they wouldn't let us run Hoosier tires, which we did. But right. okay. um, three sets of tires. Yeah, we finally figured out the combination. <laughs> <laughs> well, good. Well, it looks like you're having a great time, and I just want to thank you both for talking with us. You bet. Thank you. Yep. Thank you. Thank you. Don Warnicky, Hampton, Iowa, 69 Camaro. He's got a 67 295.